I'm this old stoner, and I'm fixing to have a heart a fart, a fart attack. If you don't know what a fart attack is, that's just having fun with our life. And if you have fun with art, whether it's live or not, you're part of Fart Club. Amen. And tonight, this is uh, Catfish Jones' layer CD playing in the background. You guys let me know if I need to turn it up or turn it down. And what I'm going to do today let me get over to the, uh, let me go over to the studio. Actually, just click this little button. You want me to show you? One of these days, I'm going to have to show you how I, uh, this little setup I've got here. Because it's super easy. Uh, and it's getting better all the time. Hey, Jim Siegel. Right on. Uh, so this is what I'm going to use tonight. I had lunch with my sister today. Uh, and she's been looking at my stuff and she told me she almost she insists for me to keep uploading the pictures onto Instagram um, but anyway she really likes the blending technique uh, with the sock you know that blending technique and I love that too so that's kind of what I'm gonna do tonight uh, something along those lines and that whole technique that guy's stuff looks so easy and quick to do and looks so good um, that uh, I have this big giant canvas that I I mean and even like the, the oh yes Ned this is what I was telling you this is what it is they've got the 10 packs they've got the 10 packs uh, and I'm pretty sure I could be wrong but it seemed like any size them they had while well, they were normally worth their 20 bucks they were 10 bucks without the 40 percent off people uh, my sister likes the stuff she wants one she's gonna give me a gift card to hobby lobby uh, so tonight that's what i'm gonna do i didn't see everyone telling me that uh so it's probably about three o'clock where mark is uh, hey bo um but these are the colors I'm going to use. Um, I'm just going to be blending them. I'm going to use blue and green because those are the, the colors Mark loves. And then yellow because I know, and you know, and anybody that knows colors, that you can mix blue, yellow, and green together all day and you don't get mud because there's no complementary color in there. Um, I mean, you'll, might, you'll either end up with a dark, dark blue or dark green <coughs> anyway uh, and uh, painting I'm kind of copying uh, let's see if I got got it up here this is basically the picture I'm going to uh, this is what I'm using as my reference or my jumping off point uh, and I really like that guy's stuff and I got some ideas I mean you don't need to stop with what he's doing but what he does is really cool I really like it I don't drip it I might sometimes I did a whole bunch of more on marks uh, after the stream I probably worked on it um, I filmed some more of it but uh, I'm hoping to have a uh, oh, I bumped the table let me uh, let me just get into it um, first I need some black because that's how he started off he started off with black and I'm thinking yep that's a good idea um, oh I'm almost out of the regular black I got tons of magic black but it doesn't uh, I probably should have done magic black on it. yeah um, I think I will I think I'll squirt a little bit of the magic black on there because this first black that I'm putting on here basically is just to remind me that uh, I need to keep the two areas separate at least for now 
So I think I just use it, and the, yeah, and this is wet, and it will flow better too than regular paint. Uh, because I'm going to use a brush on this. I'm going to use a brush on this part. Hey Nez, if you know what the names of the songs are, oh, let me get back over to chat. I don't really need to to look at this guy's picture. I I've watched this a few times to see how he gets there, and I mean, it's a. Uh... Oh, you love the new logo and my little thing. Yeah, me too. It's, I've been using that other one for a while. Hey, Bostar, right on, dude. Dancing on the ceiling like Billy Eilish. You need to do a Billy Eilish. Man, that little girl is so talented. Oh, wow. That went better than I was expecting. Oh, and um, one of these guys, I'm going to start. And you know the thing about uh, working on the canvas? I mean, I, I was looking at the prices of what I was doing before. Um, okay. That's all I need to do with that for now, but I don't want it to dry out. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get like a little damp towel because later on, I think in the end, I'm going to need that brush in the black. Okay. So now what did I want to do? Okay. Uh, I want to get, hey, for Night World, how you doing? I want to start with this dark blue and instead of doing it like um okay yeah put a good blob of that dark blue on there thalo blue lake blue and um Oh yeah, I got this big old, and this tube, yeah, this this tube of white at Hobby Lobby, their brand of paint is always half price. So uh, I want to squirt a big old blob of it up there, but I'm afraid I might make a mess. I've done that a lot recently, so I'm just going to, this is what I'm going to do. Oh, I got it, I got it, and that's what these other brushes is going to be dealing with these okay. Let me just, uh, I'm just going to do this and just kind of mix all this, start, you know, putting this paint on the canvas here. Smear it around, mix these up a little bit, smear this around up. Oh, 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 oh. don't want it to fall off over onto the other side. Those guys are afraid of gravity. Well, if the earth is flat, I shouldn't have to worry, right? There is no gravity up there. The earth is flat. Okay. Oh, yeah, I like that. I like that. Bring it on over here. Bring it on over here. Probably going to want more dark over there. It's buried in the grave. Oh, that's what I'll do. And it's growing um, deeper. Yeah, I'll grab a little putty knife over here and scoot this white. A little white over here. Because that white's fixing to get very light blue. This starry night, neither touch the side of seeing your eyes, and it's still there. Down into this a little bit. So now I'll grab me a grab me a sock. It's still there. Grab me this sock. 
It's very and if I do this right, maybe I need to do it with one sock. What I want to do, I think, is, uh, oh yeah, and that's the point. It's like you're, I think what you're trying to get are these, these ribs are your texture. So, then you just start dabbing it. Bring it down into this other stuff real easy. And probably just keep going back and forth with it. Smoothing it out as much as I want. Getting it darker. Blending it in more. Oh yeah. That did came out really nice. Actually, I think I'm gonna put. Oh, I know. See, there's still a lot of dark. Oh man, this this is just. This is just so therapeutic and so easy. Okay. So yes, yes, that that went very well. And I only used a little bit of this sock. Um, and I don't want to do anything. There's a really cool texture on it. I mean, it didn't pick up the ribs. I'm sure if I had like uh, patted on it more and like patted it down flat, it would have uh, had ribs more like that. So now what do I want to do? Okay, so that, uh, I kind of want to do the same thing, but I want to do it. Oh, I've never even opened this tube of paint. Um, I've gotten better about being able to figure out how to open it. Oh yeah, I just want to leave it like that. Um, and it's been a while. I've been working on the black canvas. Uh, some of the ones that I did on the black canvas, the originals he had done on a white canvas. So that's why I'm like going like, hmm. And um, it's like I don't like green too much. I mean, I have a hard time with greens and stuff. So, as I was thinking about doing this one, you saw the original one. He did, it was had purple and yellow. It was it looks really awesome. I mean, if the stuff didn't look awesome, I probably wouldn't be doing it. Um, okay, so how did I want to do this? Okay, so that's kind of what he did with his. He had his blue go from a dark blue to a white. And then he had a purple into a yellow. But what I'm going to do, instead of purple into a yellow, I'm going to try and do a really dark green uh, into the yellow. And I may have put way too much dark green on there. And then I was going to put light green. So let me mix these on here first. Um, I wish I would put more of the light green, but I never used the dark green. So let's see how it goes. Combo. I, I don't I don't quite understand what the combos are, but. So what do I, oh yeah, so basically I'm going to do kind of the same thing I did on the other side uh, with this dark green. Yeah, and the black line in the center was just, mostly just to remind me. And I got way too much, yeah, I can, it sure seems like I got way too much dark green. Mm. 
See what I did there? I don't know. I don't know if that is a uh, professional. Oh, oh, I've been trying to think of neat little... Li hey, Warsaw! Yeah, did, did I leave a comment on what you were... Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, uh, Ox... What, what is it? Oz... Art. He's come in here a few times. He does wood burning stuff. He's a buddy of Matt Kimball that, that comes in here once in a while. Okay. So... Yeah, that, I think, um, that looks pretty good there. Um, I'm kind of afraid to put white on there with that one, so I think what I'm going to do is, where did, is this, is this, okay. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to apply it directly with this sock. Yeah, I've really been getting into the uh, painting lately. I don't know when I'm going to be drawing again. I was sketching around on my little pad here earlier. Um, oh no, it wasn't white. That's what am I thinking? It's not the color I wanted to put on. Not because of you. I know that I got limits, but I ain't giving up now. Now I know the way it's gonna sound, but I'm oh, just man, saying I just kinda... what I found. If it's up to me, not too bad yet. It's not too be, bad yet. I'm not out of control. I do have a tendency to get out of control at times. See if I can get that blue off of it. Because we're through, not because of you. Or just blend it in. Yeah, that would be good. I know that I got limits. Got more on my feet. I know that it takes time. I know you got problems, and you know I'm probably just getting too too uh, been out of shape for nothing. But it's because I want to put yellow there, and yellow always has a tendency to uh, just get lost. I want to have a nice bright yellow. You know where to find me. Just give me a reason. Just give me a sign somehow. I know that I got limits, but I ain't giving up now. Got your wheel on the line, you're ready to go. Oh, you know what? No. Let me see. I got another one. I don't want to get. I, there's all kinds of green over there, so. Here we go. Let me just get a whole nother brush off. That way I can be sure that I have at least one corner over here that is a nice bright Cooking with gas. You got someone on the outside. You cut them off so they can't get by. Even with the old triple juice. They're gonna catch you cause you're fast and loose. You're grinning. You're rolling fast and loose, my friend. So keep it up there out of luck. You're rolling fast and loose. We all looking for that fastest time. I see you at the finish line. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to let that dry just a little bit. Hey, Lisa. Oh, you guys, hook up with Lisa. She's doing a special... Uh, birthday thing for me tomorrow if you've never gone to her show on Sundays Sundays she has the most unique 
quiz show. It is really awesome. I mean, uh, if you're uh, if you're alive, you should go. If you are, are you you should go over there. It's great to just hang out. There's all kinds of cool people over there. She works her butt off of it. She plans it. She has all sorts of. It's very very. It's it's one of the best shows on YouTube as far as I'm concerned of the people that I watch um, that have like a weekly show that has been very consistent I mean I'm not there every time and I'm just so flattered that you're doing that for me and you guys might find out something about me if you go because well I'll tell you what when uh, I was giving Lisa my little questionnaire I uh, I had a good buzz going and it was, well, it was one of those situations where I could leave walls and walls, oh, walls of text and I had just gotten my new phone so I didn't even have to type it. All I had to do was talk into the phone. Um, <laughs> and there's still more. I just, I just gave you the tip of the iceberg. Man, this looks so cool. I hardly want to do anything else, but you guys know if you've seen the other ones like this. This is just the uh, this is just the background. But if you want to know an easy way to blend colors, you just witnessed it live. On the Fart Attack Show. Oh, and the godfather of fart, Mark Bun Jones, is in England. He's in Liverpool. At his mummy's. Sleeping if he can sleep, but... He's, he's got jet lag big time. It was everyone else was uh, ready for bed when he was streaming earlier. I missed the live one, but not by much. I missed it by about an hour, and he said it was nine or ten. Okay, so now let me bleep, bring that black out, back out, and this time I'm actually going to use paint. This isn't the gesso, this is actually paint. Let me do that. Back a little bit. The gesso did. Well, and I haven't been thinning my paint at all because when I was had that cheap paint, um, Oh God, it was like, it was supposed to be acrylics, but it was more like thick watercolors. It wasn't really that good. And let's see, I want to do another little Where's, where's my sock? Oh, I hope I didn't throw them both into the water. Looks like I did, but I've got, yeah, there we go. I've got my things that I think will be good. One of these little, uh, what do they call them, the microfiber cloth? A little microfiber cloth. I think I'm going to cut a corner of this off. Hey, we got the good life after all. Do I want to do hey, that? We got the good life after all. No, I think, I, I think I'm going to kind of leave it like that. And I'm going to go into... Uh, I'm having a hard time making up my mind on what I'm going to do next. I'm kind of feeling like I need to take a little break and go. Uh, no, I've got five minutes. I've got five minutes if I want to stick to my schedule. So, let me know. 
been wanting to do it for the last two. Where'd my scissors go? That's what I'm looking for. I see all sorts of something going on over there. There they are. Oh, I was cutting up some boards and stuff. I got this really cool new idea. Basically, if you saw how I was using the... Uh, Exactly, but uh, I had to do it. I had to do that. Okay, now let's see if I have enough time. Four minutes. Four minutes. I didn't set my timer or anything. And basically, all I want to just do is Oh yeah, because I got some new stuff to do. That, that was why. Uh, if I can hang on to them. Let me see. Oh yeah, this ought to be pretty cool. There was water in that. That may have taken a little bit too far. Let's see, what else can I do? How many? 
Oh, I just hit the 30 minute mark. That's okay, I'm gonna splatter it just a little bit. Oh, I know, I know. I got one one more thing I need to do. I need to, I need to do this again. Splatter it, where's my, where's my, my splatter brush? I don't want to splatter too much. I've been splattering a little bit too much lately. When the morning came, I still wasn't thinking right. Forgive me, baby, if I hurt so deep inside. Forgive me, baby, if I hurt so deep inside. When the morning came, I still wasn't thinking right. My mistakes play in stereo. Over the static, go oh, so slow. Telling me things you already know. Alright, that's it. I'm done. That's the night stream. Oh! Ain't gonna go away. But when the morning comes, you know I just no. can't stay. Believe me, baby, I'm as good as I had fun. I, I hope you guys did too. Believe me, baby, I'm Bye. as good as what I said. Remember, when the morning comes, you know I you're just in, oh, there's only stay. one rule of the park club. Have fun with your art. Good night. Mistakes play instead.